NASA just announced three million dollar prize to clean up moon poop. Yep, you heard that right, but this is more than just a human waste. It could shape the future of life beyond Earth. And why is this happening now? And what does it mean for future missions to the moon and Mars? Stick around cause you are going to want to hear this. NASA is preparing for long term missions on the moon. And that means building lunar habitats where astronauts will live, work and yes, go to the bathroom. But waste disposal in space isn't as simple as flushing it away. Now NASA's open challenge has the world racing for a solution. Now in this video, will break down the moon poop price, the real problem NASA is facing and how this could impact the future of human space exploration. Now let's be real, waste management isn't the most glamorous part of space travel but it's absolutely essential. On earth we rely on gravity and water systems but on the moon there is no plumbing, no swears and no bacteria rich soil to break anything down. Left unmanaged, human waste could contaminate vital systems or even pose health hazards to astronaut living in closer lunar habitats. So how did NASA deal with this problem in past? And what's changing now? During the Apollo missions, astronauts had to use plastic bags. Yes, it was uncomfortable and awkward as it sound. Waste could be stored and brought back to Earth. But that approach simply won't work for long-term missions. With Artemis aiming to establish permanent outposts, NASA needs safe, efficient and sustainable waste system and fast. In March 2025, NASA officially launched the Lunar Surface Innovation Initiative, offering a $3 million prize to teams who can create a solution for processing human waste, including urine, feces, and even hygiene items, right on the moon. It's not just about disposal, it's about recycling, reclaiming water, and protecting astronauts' health. This challenge isn't just for scientists, it's open to universities, startups, and citizens inventors across the globe. NASA's ideal solution would be compact, energy efficient, require minimal maintenance and function to extreme lunar conditions. On the moon, gravity is one-sixth of Earth's temperature swing from boiling hot to freezing cold, and there's no atmosphere. Some teams are exploring bioreactors, while others are using chemical breakdown systems. And here is the kicker, this same tech might also be used on Mars. Believe it or not, space poop might be a part of the solution, not the problem. Researchers are working on a system that can convert human waste into methane, fuel, compost, and even clean in water. If perfected, this could support long duration missions, reduce resupply needs and even enable framing on the moon. Yes, poop powered greenhouses might actually be a thing. NASA has been dealing with the space waste on the International Space Station for over 20 years. Their urine is filtered and reused as a drinking water, a process astronauts call yesterday coffee. But what about solid waste? That's stored and burned in Earth's atmosphere. Clearly that won't work on the moon. This is why NASA is pushing the innovation frontier now before lunar bases become reality. Interestingly, the technologies born from NASA's poop challenge might benefit Earth too. Off-grid communities, refugee camps, and remote areas could use compact waste to resource system. Just like how the freeze-dried food we associate with astronauts now feeds millions in emergencies, space sanitation might be your next big leap in sustainability. Now NASA wants everyone to think big, not just major companies. If you're a student, engineer, designer, or just someone with an idea, you can join the challenge through NASA's Centennial Challenges program. Submissions are open and finalists could receive funding, mentorship and potentially that massive $3 million prize. Cleaning up after ourselves is a part of being human, even on the moon. This challenge is more than just about waste. It's about making space habitable, sustainable and truly livable for the next generation of explorers. Whether it's a poop to power or lunar compositing, NASA's challenge proves that sometimes even the messiest problems lead to the most brilliant innovations. Stay tuned because space just got a whole lot more. Now if this blew your mind or made you laugh, hit that like button and subscribe. We are bringing you the weirdest, wildest and most important updates from across the cosmos. And hey, let's face the future of space is full of surprises. I'll meet you in the next video.